taking this. You're lucky a card is all you're losing tonight. <gasps> Next time, pick on someone your own size. <laughs> What's up? Huh? <laughs> wow, is my breath really that bad? Lousy obelisks, whispering behind our backs, then just strutting off. Tell you guys, they're talking about the dual giant. Dual giant? Yeah, some ginormous guy who's been challenging all the obelisk blue students to duels and winning. By the way, the scary part is he only comes out at midnight. Wait, I have heard about this. He takes their cards, too. Yup, he makes them play with an ante. You know, when you put up your best card, and if you lose, you have to hand it over? Isn't that illegal, though? Sure is, which is why he duels in disguise. You see, he wears all the blue blazers of all the obelisks he's beaten. Hmm. What an absolute nightmare! Some rogue duelist roaming the campus, making a mockery of my obelisks, making a mockery of me! And worse yet, this dual giant's breaking campus law with that anti-rule! Under my watch! If Chancellor Shepard found out, I'd get fired! Huh? <sighs> Jade! Wait, of course! He could be the perfect way out of this predicament! Oh, Jade, my boy! He's being nice. Something's wrong. How would you like to have no homework for the rest of the year? Huh? No homework? Oh. You and Cyrus both. Well, if you help me, that is. So, what do you say? All right. Wait, help him doing what? Nothing, really. Just going on a kind of field trip. <laughs> I love field trips. And I love grilled cheeses, but sometimes it depends on who's serving them. So, Teach, where's this field trip taking us? All around campus. I need you to duel and ID the fellow having these illegal matches. You know the one. They call him the Duel Giant, I believe. Sure, the guy that's whooping your dorm. <laughs> I, I don't keep track of such things. Good luck, Jaden. <laughs> this is perfect. Once Jaden reports back to me with whoever this Duel Giant is, I'll have them both expelled for illegal dueling. I can't lose. All right, let's find us this dino-sized duelist. Uh, listen, Jaden, is it too late to say that this is a bad idea? Hmm? Doesn't Crowler really not like you? He sure doesn't. But how could I turn down no homework, a field trip, and a big duel? Uh, by saying no? I mean, do you even know how to say no? Yes. Oh, uh... man. So how are we going to find this guy? Mm -hmm. Wait, so we don't even have a plan? This is getting worse every minute. Then I guess we better hurry up and get started. Jaden, if we keep taking breaks like this, we're never going to find the duel giant. Really? Good. Come on, Cy. This looks like a good duel. All right. I'll play... Uh... Hmm. Sweet. He's got Earthquake. This match is as good as over. All he's got to do is throw it down. Come on, Briar. You've got him right where you want him. Now win this thing and go home. Just forget everyone watching you. Now. 
Should I use Earthquake to switch his marauding captain to defense mode? Or should I attack with my mad sword beast? Get a move on! I'd like to get home sometime this school year! Uh... What's the matter, short stack? Can't see over the cards? Looks like the little baby's gonna cry. Wanna call your mom? Eeny, meeny? Mighty Mo! Make a move! You're going way too slow! Uh, okay. Uh, I guess I'm gonna attack with my mad sword beast. What? what? I activate my face down card! It's called reinforcements and it hands me 500 attack points! And I think I'll give them to Marauding Captain! And he was so close. A classic huh? case of stage fright. Hey, Bastion. The boy has tremendous skill, but he hasn't yet been able to handle the pressure of dueling in public like this. I didn't think it was possible, but on his knees, he's even smaller than he was before. <laughs> I think I need some glasses to see him. Better yet, a magnifying glass. Try a microscope. <laughs> Yeah, Karibo. I felt that too. So, what's the crew up to these huh? days? We're looking for a giant. A giant? Yeah, you know, the one who's been beating all the obelisks? Yes, I've heard about this titan. Oh. Hey, speaking of, check it out. Seriously, I mean, just look at the size of that guy. Who? Beauregard, please. He's no dual giant. What are you talking about? He's gigantic. <laughs> but he's no duelist, Sai. He's at the Academy studying to design games, not play them. I know him. He can hardly duel. Games, huh? Oh, well. Just what I was thinking, Karibo. Uh, Jaden, wait up! Well, looky what we got here! Someone's exceeding this hall's maximum weight limit. Are you catching my drift, wide load? You are in my way! Come on. That's better. Next time, maybe use the freight elevator. <laughs> freight elevator. <laughs> hey! Huh? Hold up! Sorry, but I didn't want to wait till midnight to duel you. Huh? And what's that mean? It means I know you're the duel giant. So let's throw it down right here. Jaden? Uh, what are you talking about? There's no such thing as the duel giant. Come on, Beauregard. <laughs> no. 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 Hmm. Great. Jaden, I really don't think that guy's the dual giant. No joke. I mean, you heard what Bastion said. That big guy's a game designer, not a duelist. It doesn't add up. No, it doesn't. Yet. But it will. Jaden, you really think the giant will show up tonight? Shh. Not if we keep blabbing. Look, there's two things I do with my mouth, talk or eat. So either you give me a grilled cheese or... Ah! Ah! The giant! Ah! Oh, I'm not running. Wait up. Huh? He took my best card. Which way did he go? Uh, huh? Uh, excuse me. Coming through. He's from the arena. Hold it! Caught you, big guy! Not so quick on your feet, huh? Uh, you know what, Jaden? Uh, uh, I don't think he really needs to be. I mean, who in their right mind chases a giant? The same guy who's gonna duel him. It's time to throw down! Say we get this duel started, big guy. Huh? All right, if you say so. I guess that we're in this together now, aren't we? 
Here you go. Since I know you're only dual playing with an ante, I'll put this card up. So be it, duelist. Ah, yeah! Okay, get your game on! If you insist, I summon Giant Orc in attack mode! First move, first mistake. See, when Orc attacks, he switches to defense mode. That wouldn't be a problem, except that he has a grand total of zero defense points. Make your move, duelist. With pleasure! Ha! What's that? You want to come out and play? Sounds good! I play Winged Karibo in defense mode! Your turn, big guy! And it will be one to remember! First I draw, then I'll attack with Giant Orc Bone Basher! <laughs> I hope it was worth it! Because now your giant orc's battle mode changes to defense. Not that he has any. Not that he needs any. I summon second goblin in attack mode. Wait, uh. that's a monster, but he's playing him as a spell. That's because once per turn, I can treat him as a spell card. A spell card that has the power to switch my orc from defense to offense. Uh. To mm -hmm. offense? What's offensive is his face. Yeah, can't you wrap a couple of blazers around him? But hey, if you won't do something about it, well, guess that I'll just have to. With this, polymerization. And I'll use it to fuse elemental hero Clayman and Verstinatrix. <laughs> now allow me to introduce the elemental hero Rampart Blaster. <laughs> and I'll put her in defense mode. But that doesn't mean I can't play her special ability. It blasts your life points to the tune of half a Rampart's attack points. <laughs> yep. It's Boregard. I thought he couldn't duel. What should I do? You can stop the charade for starters. How about the real duel giant comes out now? Huh? <gasps> So then it was him? But why? How did you know? Well, back at the arena, I felt how mad you were at those obelisks. Then when I saw this big guy was your friend, it started coming together. But I lost that duel you saw. Why would you think I could beat all those obelisks? Because I heard that you were a great duelist. Only problem was you had stage fright, which cleared up why the duel giant only came out at night and used a radio transmitter. All right, well, it's over now. Just give back the cards and... What do you mean over? Nothing's over! <gasps> I won't just go home and be Little Briar again. Everyone makes fun of me. They say I'm small, a shrimp. I'm tired of them always laughing at me, don't you see? That's why I get nervous, I couldn't concentrate. Then I met Beauregard. They teased him too, so we decided to make a promise. We'd get all of them back, right where it hurt the most. And we'll play with the anti rule. So if they lose, they'll give us their best card. But what if we get caught? You just let me worry about all that. Of course. That's why you put on the costume. So you wouldn't get caught for breaking the rules. That's right. Well, what now? Your secret's out. Pretty soon, everyone's going to know who you are, including Dr. Crowler. That is, unless you and I continue this duel. Huh? Out in the open. Hmm. <gasps> Out in the open? Well, I guess you're not giving me any choice. Let's do this. Yeah. Draw, Beauregard. <sighs> I summon Goblin King in attack mode. Zero attack points? Not for long. See, now for each warrior monster that I sent to the graveyard, I can summon a half goblin. Go! Defense mode! Now I play Goblin King's special ability! It lets him gain a thousand attack and defense points for every fiend monster on the field other than himself! And I have three of them! What the? Three thousand attack points? So not good! Now Goblin King! Attack Rampart Blaster! Giant Orc 
Attack Jaden directly! And in case you forgot, your winged Karibo is still up for grabs! Face it, you're gonna lose, Jaden! Especially since my Goblin's effect has just switched my Orc back to attack mode! Your Karibo? Soon he's gonna be all mine! Want him? Well, then you're gonna have to earn it, and I'm not gonna make it easy for you, because small guy or not, I'm gonna give you my very best. <sighs> you want an example? Here. This should do nicely. I play the spell Pot of Greed. It lets me draw two more cards. And next, I'll summon the elemental hero Sparkman in attack mode. <laughs> If Sparkman doesn't have enough zap as it is, I equip him with Spark Blaster! If you don't know how it works, let me tell you. I got three shots. Each changes the battle mode of a monster. Oh, no! Oh, yes. Now I played the warrior returning alive. This allows me to bring back a warrior from the graveyard, and I choose Clayman. Wait! There's more! Next, I play Polymerization and combine Clayman and Sparkman to create Elemental Hero Thunder Giant! And he's a real giant! Because when I use his special ability, he can bruise up any monster that's original attack points are lower than his own! Like your giant orc, for example, but that's just the start! I still have his normal attack, and I'm gonna use it on the Half Goblin! What? I still have life points left. Well, not after this you won't. I activate Diffusion! It splits my monster into two again. And guess what? That means two more attacks on you, Clayman's. And now it's Sparkman's turn. Attack Goblin King! Jaden? Now Jaden the Giant Slayer. They beat us. We're through. No, not we. Please just turn me in for Get Briar. Huh? Beauregard? I've always been alone, and I'm not gonna let them expel you for showing me what it means to have a friend. After all, didn't we always promise to stand up for each other? You're the best duelist I've ever seen. I won't let them kick you out of here. What about you? Your dream of being a game designer. Not all dreams come true. Oh, regard. Hold everything. Hmm? I'm not turning either of you two in. I know what it's like to be made fun of. Everyone gets a dose of that sometimes. We're cool. What? I only said I'd turn you in so that you'd come out. You know, duel me in the open and realize that you could. It was a close duel, Briar. You should be proud. You know, Jaden, I guess you're right. I did play well in front of people, too. Maybe I can do it again. Of course you can. I just hope it's not against me. <laughs> now get out of here before Dr. Crowler catches you. Thanks, Jaden. We'll make good. Hey, wait up. Of course, there's a problem. Huh? Because we let him go, we're gonna have to start doing homework again. Aww. Including all the stuff we've missed while looking for this guy. So let me get this straight. You found the dual giant, beat him, and then he was able to escape? Yep, that's what happened, Teach. Last I saw, he was headed up a beanstalk or something. Uh, and you're saying you didn't duel using the illegal anti-rule, but all the other obelisks did? Did they? I heard they all just kind of lost their cards. Temporarily. Yeah, I found my rare cards this morning, too. Dude, it just turned up in my deck. My baby Now I can't miss it so much. Mm. So first you find the dual giant, then he escapes. First all those cards were lost, now they're found. First I had no homework, and now... Keep writing! Chilling out with the crew in the schoolyard. Finding trouble, never looking too hard. Well, back at class, they never taught us this. <laughs>